Hi guys, Coach Jason here. Here's Adam cleaning up. Hi. <laughs> we just finished our workout today. Um, we're doing a Masters Hammer and Chisel, which is more weightlifting based. What did we do today? We did a Max Hammer Strength. Um, today is day three of week three. Yay! <laughs> but I've been getting <clears throat> a lot of questions um, just from like some of the videos I've been posting about. Um, like what equipment and what tools I use uh, to be successful here at home. Um, because let's face it, it's, it is kind of easier to have everything right here versus uh, having to get up, get dressed, and head out to the gym and hope that you can get all the equipment you need there. <laughs> but um, it's actually not terribly a lot to have at home in order to be super effective. Like you can literally have what I'm about to show you with my setup to you can have absolutely nothing to as long as you have um, the just yourself and a good program to walk you through everything. So um, just to show you uh, some of the quick tools I use. First of which is uh, Beachbody On Demand. Um, as you can see right here, this is the program we're doing. This is Master's Hammer and Chisel. But this is essentially like the Netflix or Hulu of, of fitness. Like it's just loaded with programs. And this, this right here is the standard member library. So all of this comes standard or if you do um, get the all access, you get all of these programs as well. Um, and so it just makes it super nice just to be able to turn on the TV, open the, the program and you have access to everything. Um, so like I said, we have been doing right there, because there's Body Beast. We've done parts of that, but we all, uh, we're doing Master's Hammer and Chisel right now. Um, since we're doing that, and that's mainly weight-based, uh, this is the bench that I use. Uh, it's not the most expensive thing. It's uh, the Cap Strength brand. Um, I liked it because it has this uh, clip on it here, which, let's see if we can do that. Uh, with one hand. No, you can't really do it with one hand. Well, kind of. It slides and then clicks in. So it is pretty sturdy. Like, it has a little bit of give to it, but that's the bench that I use. Um, and then, of course, we have just, like, a, a good resistance band and everything. But then these are my new favorite toys. Um, we did go from uh, just, um, like, individual dumbbells and everything but that does get a little bit bulky in like um, where to keep it all and everything. But these are worth the investment. Um, I love them. Um, they're the Power Block Sport 50s. So they literally go from 10 to 50 pounds. I'll just kind of show you there. So it goes in increments of five all the way up to 50. Um, now the one common thing about these that I've heard is that these little things break. They only break if you drop them on the ground, so please don't drop them and mistreat any of your tools. But anyway, like I said, with this little slide out thing there, like it goes anything from just the handheld right there from 10 pounds, and then say you wanted to do 25, you just slide this into the 25, and there it comes out. And you got 25 weight, 25 pound weights right there. But those are my absolute favorite things um, just because it makes it super simple and easy to switch weights during your workout. And it just helps set you up for success there. So like I said, it's, um, it's not a ton of equipment. It is an investment. But what about your health isn't, isn't an investment. I mean, every dollar that you spend practically in your in your waking living days <laughs> is a dollar spent on your health. So we have a choice there. <clears throat> See, sorry, I just finished work. <laughs> like I said, so my voice is a little dry. But um, with every dollar that you spend on yourself, you're either doing something to benefit your health, whether physical, nutritional, spiritual, mental health, or you're doing something to detract from it. And that is something that was eye-opening for me to, uh, like whenever I was 70 pounds heavier, whenever I was told by my doctor that in my early 20s I was headed towards heart disease and diabetes and pancreatitis and 
even an early death if I was going the way I was going. So, uh, yeah, so don't ever undervalue yourself. Don't ever say that you can't do something because because you just don't feel like you can or that you can't afford it because guys like my husband and I, like I just coming from that financial perspective we came from a place of not having much like there was a point in my life too where we like we would literally I would go grocery shopping and literally break down and kind of like there, there was one time I legit cried in the middle of the grocery store because I couldn't afford the simple basic stuff but even through all that, we found a way to do what we could with what we had at the time. And since we've grown together and everything, like we've budgeted more to put in towards our health. Because your health is the one gift that's just going to, it's going to keep you around longer. So obviously it's, it's worth every penny. So, and you are worth every penny. And that was something I had to come to terms with too, is I had self-worth issues as I'm sure we we all do at some point so but um but yeah these are my tools for success here at home um if you have any questions about anything else that I use or how um we set everything up feel free to ask definitely be sure to, to continue to subscribe to get all my videos and um yeah introduce yourself below too and and uh if you use different equipment than I do or have any other recommendations, I always love hearing what other people are using. So, hope you all are having a great morning, and I will chat with you all later. Bye, guys.